<clears throat> good morning, good morning. In the news this morning, it is not morning, it is Monday, it's 3 p.m. and I have not yet left my apartment. Yeah. Some days I, if I don't have like a full Sunday to myself for like a relaxing few hours of a Sunday, and yesterday was not a relaxing Sunday at all. Um, I need the Monday time, the Monday hours to do that. And I'm not really relaxing, like I'm actually working from my bed. But um, I just need to like not have to be or go anywhere. It's probably a story I'm just telling myself, you know, but um, I it worked well for me today, so I'm not upset about it. Anyway, so I'm moving on Saturday. I'm moving this week. As you can see, my room is a complete disaster because I'm packed. That's my window's falling down. Awesome. My room's a complete disaster. Everything is being put into bags and packed. This shelving system needs to come down. And yep. Um, so I'm packing little by little. And then everything is going to be moved on Saturday. But I sort of just feel like everything's like up in the air and I just can't wait to be settled. Now I'm working on an edit for my friend Karen for a Strongest Beautiful campaign she is a part of. And yes, I know I'm using iMovie and I'm being lazy because Premiere is just actually like malfunctioning recently. It's just like shutting down. So I created this. We actually filmed this back in the summer. Here, I'll play you some of it. Um, Uh, so we filmed that over the summer and now we're going to use the footage for a campaign that she's working on with her company, Happy Belly Strong. So I'm going to finish that edit up by tonight, tomorrow, and send it over to her. So I um, have some other new prospects as well for some video editing for fitness and, well, Hellnet. I just tried to say Hellness. Wellness and health at the same time it came out Hellness. This happens to me all the time. Yesterday I tried to say spot me, like remember when you spotted me, and I said remember when you spotified me. Just was editing that, now I'm just getting ready to actually go work out. I normally don't work out around this time of day, but this is not a normal day. And then I'm gonna go train some clients at the gym, and then I'm probably gonna go home. I don't know, I might go to like a Starbucks and edit and do some more work, edit some more stuff, and then come home. I have early, early clients tomorrow, so I'm going to go to bed early tonight because I have to be up at 5. Other than that, oh, so I was at home at my mom's, my parents' house, this past weekend, which, or just yesterday, felt like forever, to be quite honest. It was just a long day. I met the sister's boyfriend, we had breakfast, um, yeah, then my sister and I went shopping for some new stuff for my apartment because she's going to drive to the city with that stuff plus some stuff I still had at my parents house plus my cat which is now I'm going to be living with which is amazing and I'm super excited um I was looking through a lot of the things I had had at my in my old room and I came across this gem This is my diary from middle school and high school. I just can't even, I'll read you the first page. June 8th, 1999. Next week starts exams and I'm really nervous. I hope I will pass all my exams. During this year, I have met three friends. They are now my best friends, Megan, Alex, and Carolyn. Megan thinks that Justin is her angel. Justin meaning Justin Timberlake. <laughs> Megan thinks that Justin is her angel, but it's sort of fading. Um, now she likes Megan also wants him to ask her out. Alex is very small, but nice. And Carolyn is really smart and funny. I can't believe it's been one year already, and I wonder who I'll meet next year. I'm sad, and then I crossed it out, glad to leave this year. 
and then I wrote he 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 next to it. Um, I'm glad to leave this year, but next year will be fun too. <laughs> I don't even know what to read next. Um, okay, hold on. This one's like kind of sad, but so I <laughs> have always had no boobs. Like I've always just been flat and whatever. It's I don't even care anymore. I actually kind of like it. It's <laughs> it's easy, but I used to be so self-conscious of it when I was little. Um, and there's a, an entry in here from when we went to try on bridesmaid dresses for my aunt's wedding. I think I was in ninth grade. And um, anyway, I'll just read it to you. It's quick. Um, so this is from February 4th, 2001. Dear Diary. And my handwriting changes like so much. Like look at this handwriting. And then look at this handwriting. Like what? Why do I have schizophrenic handwriting? I haven't written in so long. This weekend was okay at the big beginning, but now it just sucks, S-U-X. On Friday, I got to ride in Kristen's car, and Lauren's Sweet 16 was then too. It was so fun. I was dancing with Nicole and everything was great. On Saturday, I did absolutely nothing, and I realized I left my Latin and religion books at school when I have tests on them on Monday. Today, Sunday, Lauren, me, Nicole, and our moms went to pick out bridesmaid dresses. And Lauren was like, she's flat on both sides. <laughs> Sorry, Lauren. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why I'm apologizing. You said it to me. <laughs> it's my cousin. Um, you can't tell the difference. And I wanted to cry. Then I can't even get the bridesmaid dress because I'm too small. So I have to get a junior's bridesmaid dress in a 12. They have to cut back on the chest in four inches. <laughs> Nobody understands how I feel. I wouldn't make fun of them. Why do I have to be flat? I'm older than Nicole. That's my other cousin. They told me to wear a wonder bra. It's so embarrassing. I hate it. When everyone makes fun of you just because of your chest. It's so depressing and sad. But I'll show them. I will drink as much milk as I can. And kick all their asses. And then I wrote in capital letters, bitches. And so Oh my god. And then I'm not going to read the next one, but the next one is August of that same year. And I wrote, started writing, hey, haven't written in a while. Here are some updates. One, I'm still flat. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be a recurring theme. So I will leave more of those gems for another time. I'm going to go to the gym and work out and just get out of my head and get out of my room and that stuff. So on to the next.